Welcome to Brown's Rod and Custom, your home for street rods, muscle cars, and Volkswagen content. This is my dad, Big Ron. He's our body man and fabricator. This is my beautiful wife, Megan, our editor-in-chief and supporter. And this is me, Adam, the designer and mechanic for our projects. If you find our videos helpful, like and subscribe for more content. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I wanted to do a couple things here, a couple quick installs with you. Um, as you guys probably already know, we got some of our vintage air cool products in, one of them being the mahogany ball style shift knob with the shift pattern. And we also got the cup holder. Okay. Um, so in this video, I'm going to do the shift knob. Okay. Now this is mounting it on an MP trigger shifter. Um, the shift knob itself is freaking gorgeous. Okay. But it comes with this, okay, little adapter. You just thread it in here, um, like so. Kind of set that off out of the way for a second. You just spin your stock MP shift knob off. And then you put a new one. You just spin it on. I will tell you, threading the stock shift knob off is a chore. Uh, and there you go. There's the MP, or not the MP, the uh, VACP, the Vintage Air Cool Products Mahogany Style Shift Knob. It's the ball style, not the stock style, which is more of pancake. So it's the ball style with um, for the MP trigger shifter. Uh, so if you're ordering this, the uh, one of the drop downs uh, is what thread size do you have, what shifter do you have. If you have an MP trigger shifter, you want to uh, click on MP, or I think it's Hurst slash MP. Um, but otherwise, guys, there's the uh, there's the shifter. I'm gonna come over there and give you guys a closer look. Be right there. gorgeous oh my god now that's gonna match the steering wheel and the e-brake cover um, the e-brake cover um, I've got inside that matches the steering wheel as well so something to check out now I'm gonna come back to you in a little bit and I'm gonna get some tools and we'll install the cup holder thanks for watching Browns Riding Custom Hey guys, sorry about that, the camera died. I'm going to go back through this for you. So welcome back to Brown's Rod and Custom. What we're doing here right now is installing some of the vintage air-cooled products uh, that arrived a couple minutes ago. The first one was the mahogany ball style shift knob with the shift pattern on the top. And the second piece we're doing is the aluminum uh, cup holder here that mounts at the front of the shifter. So, I'm guessing that I will have to trim up, maybe, maybe not. I'll probably have to trim up my shift boot here a little bit to get this to fit all the way, but for sakes of just throwing this on here to see what it looks like, let's see what we can Okay, 
So it mounts on that front bolt. Now, I was right. I will have to trim up my boot. Not a big deal. Um, to basically get past this bracket here. But, looks pretty good. Looks really good, actually. So that's what we got there guys. We've got the shift knob installed, we've got the cup holder installed. I'm going to do a little trimming, a little whittling on my shift boot, but it gives you a cup holder, which is huge, because you need one of those in these things. So that's what I've got for you right now. Thanks for watching Browns Rod and Custom. Um, I think I might try to figure out the e-brake handle cover and uh, whatnot and go through that here in a minute. And if I do that, I'll bring you back and uh, show you what we got. Thanks for watching, guys.